These are white blood cells actively trying to fight off microplastics, but they're failing. And that's the problem, because when they fail, it sparks inflammation and a growing list of questions about what these tiny particles are doing to our bodies long term. Researchers are already linking microplastics to heart issues, even cancer. Look at these images. Those dots you see are microplastics found in animals around the world. But what's truly scary is that they're everywhere, and we can't really escape them. They're in our food, our water, the air we breathe, almost every corner of the planet, even the rain. That last one being the most surprising. Researchers found over 1,000 tons of microplastics fall on national parks every year. That's like over 120 million water bottles falling from the sky. But it's not just bottles and plastic bags. It's our clothes, cosmetics, and even car tires. Basically anything that uses plastics. And now scientists are uncovering nanoplastics, even smaller fragments, floating in the air. So what is their lasting impact? We'll have to wait to see, unfortunately. But let us know what you think in the comments.